It's congratulations, tag champion. Thank you. Yeah. So what's you've been with Gen Zero from the beginning. Mm-hmm. Yep. What has it been like now with Scotty Ryan and Ali coming in? How has the dynamic changed within the group? Um I guess the mindset um, has definitely changed um, and kind of the outlook of uh, who we are and what we're about. I guess when Don and I um, got together initially, we we kind of tried to forge our own path and, you know, we were making a lot of trouble. You know, we got up to no good taser and people, you know, uh, and I guess as time's gone on, we're bringing on, bring, bring on Scotty um, and bringing in Ali as well. Um, we kind of... To kind of refocus a little bit, you know. Yeah. Um, the main goal is still to try and make a name for ourselves, and I think you know we have now. It's a pretty um, good job. Yeah. Gen, Gen Zero is definitely the, you know, as far as stables go in Australian wrestling. I think you know we are the, the stable, um, and I guess that was always like what we intended. But yeah, mm. yeah. yeah, that's that's hard to dispute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I agree. <laughs> and you've seen Ali come up through the school, and so what? How do you feel now? Like she is the first female to win officially win a major title at ABW. Yep. Is it like a proud big brother kind of thing? Uh, it... Yeah, I guess you could kind of say that. Um, it's. I'm just glad that Gen Zero um, as a whole was able to give that platform for someone mm -hmm. like Ellie to be able to come up and be able to have this sort of opportunity. Yeah. Um, it's uh, yeah. I'm definitely very very proud. Like yeah, exceptionally proud. Um, yeah, it's awesome. No. Yeah. So you mm. like the Don? Mm -hmm. I like you the Don. You like the Don. I like obviously. him. Yeah, I like him a lot. But you <laughs> like the Don. Yes. Oh, well, I guess that would be that. Yeah. Are uh, a father. Yes. How many kids do you have? Two. Two. Do they come to shows? Yes. Uh, most of the time. Yeah. How old? Uh, so my daughter's four and my son is two. Okay. Yeah. And my daughter does not understand what's going on. She thinks, yeah, she thinks we're all friends and. When we're like wrestling around, she thinks we're hugging sometimes, and oh. you know, yeah, she says funny things. Like one time, one time, uh, uh, Don and I um, were wrestling once, and we started arguing with each other and we're pushing each other, and then uh, we like had a moment, and then we cuddled. And so then, while I was in the car and I was driving home, and I, I said to her, "Oh, did you enjoy the show?" She goes, "Oh." It was beautiful. I was like, what was beautiful? She goes, when you and your friend, the Don, got together and you gave each other a cuddle, it was so sweet. <laughs> and I was like, I couldn't stop laughing, hey. Yeah, no, but she really enjoys it. Emma has no idea. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, my daughter is Kaylee and my son is Emma. Yeah. So, it's, Don mm. was saying that his son initially, because I have a nephew mm. and I cannot wait to start bringing him to shows, but he's yet to turn two. Right. And right now, any kind of loud noise is kind of freaks him out. Right. So, like, how is he responding to... Oh, he's fine. I mean, my daughter, when her first show, she was a week old. Yeah, so uh, that's when I won the, her first show was when I won the Rising Star Cup. Kaylee, uh, for the like, up until she was about three, she came to every show, so um, she was, yeah, loud noises doesn't really bother her. Mind you though, if you're in the car and you turn on the stereo really loud, she can't stand that. I think the only circumstance where she likes loud noises is like at a wrestling show. Yeah. That's, that's a good one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How are you finding the balance between living this kind of a lifestyle mm -hmm. and being a family man? Well, it's difficult. Um, yeah, it's very, very difficult. You just got to try and make it work, I guess. Um, family's always priority more so than anything else. So it's, you know, um, yeah, wrestling kind of has to work around family. But yeah, you somehow make it work, you know. Yeah. I have for a long time, so <laughs> yeah. You're doing something right yeah, then, yeah. Yeah, yeah. And this is a question that I always love to ask for wrestlers with kids. Mm -hmm. If they turned around one day and said to you, Dad, we want to be a wrestler. Yeah. Oh, what would your response be? Yeah, cool. Just, uh, I think it'd be real. I think it'd be really good. Except, I would tell them not to do what I did, where it was like, I'm just going to be a wrestler. That's it. And I didn't. I had no like, you know, going to go to uni or TAFE or none of that. I was like, just wrestling. Like, I'm just going to wrestle. So I guess for me, like, if if like my kids were like, I want to wrestle, they'd have to go to like uni or something yeah. and like, you know, actually have some sort of backup plan um, instead of just yeah. It's yeah. pretty good advice for anyone in the artistic field or mm. not a nine to five job. Yeah. Pretty much. Yeah. 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 Because I mean, for me, like trying to juggle like real life and then wrestling without like having like an actual career has been, you know, yeah, you kind of uh, it's kind of good in a way though because you kind of like one between jobs and you know yeah. you experience a lot more than having like one yeah. set sort of way of doing things. But yeah, yeah. 
But if they wanted to be a wrestler. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think I was going to say, having this title now is kind of a testament that it's worth it. Mm -hmm. And it kind of works out in the end. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. So this is the third title right now. I'm pretty sure mm. this is um, like record tying. So just dropping that. Yeah, just, just dropping that. Casual. casual. Yeah. But uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's like record time, which is pretty cool. So that's awesome. Yeah, yeah. Well, congratulations! Yeah. I can't wait to see what happens next to you guys. Yeah, me too. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Hopefully, we don't lose these belts. None of us in Generation Zero. I'm talking to you, Don, and Scotty, and Ali. No and pressure, guys. I'm but... watching myself right now. <laughs> don't you lose that belt? So yeah. Now, hopefully, we hold on to it for a long time. And, yeah, pretty good. Cool. Yeah. Well, thank you. Cool. Thank you. Thank you. Awesome. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you.